Hi everybody, Rob Power here, and today I'm going to talk you through the process of adding and formatting text-based content into an ebook using the Pressbooks platform. And the reason why I'm creating this video, although it will be of use to anybody who's interested in working in Pressbooks, is because I'm currently working with a group of graduate students at UOIT, and as part of their coursework, they're going to be contributing chapters to this textbook on technology and the curriculum in the summer 2018 term. So frequently when you're working on a multi-contributor publication such as this, you are going to want to make sure that you have a similar formatting in terms of the structure of your document but as well as in terms of the text formatting and we're going to focus on that text formatting now now as part of this project just like with any endeavor uh, any uh, publication endeavor whether it be for a publishing house or a conference submission or a journal submission you frequently have a submission template and I've put together a sample chapter here using a submission template that I want to add into a sample chapter inside of Pressbooks. So the first thing I need to do is actually log in. Well, I'm logged in here now so I'm going to go to the admin dashboard and I need to find the chapter that I have been assigned to work on. So I click on organize and I scroll on down until I find the chapter that's assigned to me which has my author name next to it and I just click on edit I can edit the title of the chapter here now if it's different from what I originally proposed in this case I'm happy with the title so I'm gonna go back to my template I don't want to copy paste my text straight from this template into the Pressbooks video. If I do that, I might end up copying over some of the formatting and it might uh, make things a little bit of a nightmare to try and clean up the formatting and get that consistent look and feel. So I'm just going to grab this text here and do a bit of an intermediary step. I'm also not going to take the entire document all at once because that'll be a bit too much to manage. So I'm going to copy this text and as an intermediary I'm going to paste it into notepad that will clear out all of my formatting and I'm just going to make sure that I hit a hard return between each of my paragraph breaks here to make sure that I have no further issues with formatting when I paste it into WordPress or into Pressbooks I'm happy now with all of this so I'm going to take this text and copy paste it over again into Pressbooks and you can see now that I have a nice clean unformatted version here now I don't want to do anything with the bylines I'm gonna focus on my first header here which is a level 1 header it was a level 1 APA header that I used in the template so I'm gonna use a level 1 header here to do that I'm just gonna use the built-in tools that are in the formatting toolbar and select heading level one it will automatically handle that for me and because I've selected heading level one here it's going to add in the appropriate HTML code so that this is a easy to navigate digital document for anyone who has a disability or anyone who's using a screen reader application or a digital switch and it will also make sure that my chapter looks and feels the same as every other chapter in the book I don't need to touch anything on here unless I had some italicized text in my paragraph. Again, this is why I suggested that you don't take the entire document at once because you don't want to be overwhelmed trying to navigate your way through and find where you had all those elements. Now this is also a level one header, so I'm going to highlight that and select heading level one. My text is fine here. Now I know that I have an image that I want to embed in here. I'm not going to worry about uh, images now and actually this one is going to be a video. We'll look at uh, how to insert those in a later instructional video. So I'm going to move right along to my next section which is uh, this background section here. I'm going to copy the paragraph, repeat the process of putting that here into notepad, add in my break and copy paste this over into Pressbooks. And I will continue this process for the remainder of the Pressbooks chapter that I want to create. So I will add in my paragraph formatting here. 
and I will frequently save the document that I'm working on. And that's how easy it is to add in all of your text and your section level headers in here. You can go through the rest of your document and make sure that all of your text is formatted as you had it done in your Word document template, uh, all of your italics, anything like that that you wanted to add in. We will have another instructional video coming up shortly that's going to show you how to embed multimedia into your Pressbooks chapter and that will focus on embedding images as well as video.